Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to hit a real brief subject here, trying to tell you how to get roadkill for free, at least for right now. The way to get roadkill for free, there's two ways I definitely know how to do it. I do not know how to use the Roku or Apple TV, so if you're trying to watch it on a big screen, hook it up to your laptop. That's all I can tell you there. So, two ways are you can get it on your cell phone and you can get it on your computer. The cell phone will cover first because it's what everybody else in the world has and everybody can do it. You have to go to the App Store, you have to download the Motor Trend On Demand app. Once you download the app, the app is a jungle of all the other TV shows that Discovery pretty much offers. So, the way to find Roadkill is go to the search function, type in Roadkill, it'll bring it up, it'll start out with first season, second season, third season, and so on. Scroll down to the newest season, and people say, oh, I tried that, but I, I got all this credit card information. You know, They wanted a credit card to watch it. No. What happened is you clicked on one of the ones that have the lockbox on it. They're not going to let you watch that for free. There's the newest ones. All right. So you got to scroll through, look for the one that doesn't have a lockbox on it, and that's the one you're allowed to watch. They only have one per month. Previous episodes apparently are locked. Newer episodes are locked, but that one in that eight-week period is unlocked for you to watch. So once you watch it, usually at the end of the show, it's going to have ads for whatever, and then most of the ads are going to be for motor turned on demand. All right, and then after you're done watching it, it usually pops up with the same thing. Down, you know, if you want motor turned on demand, it's five dollars a month. And the way to get around that is to just restart the app. All right, and then you can go do the same thing, search the next show you want, Dirt Every Day or whatever else it is. Same thing with um, computer. You just go to motortrendondemand.com, go in there, search Roadkill. Go to the same thing, go down to the one that's not unlocked, and you can watch it there for free. All right? Now, we're going to hit on the other thing. There's been debate because of the Jalopnik article, which I believe is 100% written wrong. The, they worded it to make you think that in six weeks or four weeks' time that they're not going to do this stuff for free anymore, which kind of seems bogus because if you look, Discovery has TV shows of all the other TV shows they've had, for free that are a season old. All right. So I believe they wrote it wrong. They meant that the episodes would be eight weeks behind, not that in eight weeks it won't be there anymore. And the reason I believe that is because anybody who's ever wrote anything for any sort of article knows you put dates. You don't say in eight weeks time because you don't know when your article will be published, if published at all. And you don't know when somebody's going to read it. All right. So it's eight weeks in 2020. It's going to be different than eight weeks in 2018. All right, so that's why I believe that's 100% wrong. Plus, Dave Freiberger said that it will be eight weeks behind and free on the um, Motor Trend on Demand app. They didn't say anything about it will be free for eight weeks. They had a promotion going to get Motor Trend on Demand for $2.99 for six weeks, and I believe that's where Jim Lopnick got a little confused. All right, so you can still get the show for free. You can still watch it for free. If you're trying to watch it on the big screen TV or something like that, there's a way to do it with the Apple and Roku and all that. I don't know how to do that. If you have HDMI port on your computer and you have HDMI port on your um, big screen TV, you just plug it into your computer. All right, That's the only other way I can think of them doing it. The next thing is people are saying, oh, you know, David Freiberger and them should leave Roadkill and start it on their own. Not going to happen. Here's why. All right? You guys are saying that? But you don't even, nobody's even joined David Freiberger's YouTube channel. Yes, he has his own. So does Lucky. So does Mike Finnegan. Mike Finnegan actually has a decent following. But not enough to warrant leaving a good job doing something he likes to do and doesn't have to manage. They, they don't have to manage what's going on. They don't have to worry about video production. They just show up, do the show, have fun, and be on their way. All right? If they jumped out on their own, guess what? They're going to have to find people to help film them, money, or they're going to have to film themselves, stress, or they're going to, and then they're going to have to edit it, stress, and money, and it's not going to happen. They have it pretty good, you know? Now, if the show ever ends, for some reason, maybe they'll think about it, but they're not going to even think about it if nobody's following their YouTube channels. So my message to those guys that are saying that David Freiberger and them should, you know, step out on their own, go join his YouTube channel, all right? I wouldn't jump out and say, hey, I'm going to start a YouTube channel and nobody's, you know, on it. You know, especially if I'm already doing basically the same thing and getting paid for it, you know. So, 
go join their YouTube channels. Maybe David and Finnegan will do something on the side one day on Finnegan's YouTube channel, you know, if David ever had time, which he doesn't seem to have anyways. He does like a million things for, I don't know what it is, I guess it's Discovery now, but it used to be Hot Rod. So, you know, just touch on that. You know, if, they, if you think that he should jump out on his own and do his own YouTube thing, go, su go support him and join his YouTube channel. Both of them have it. I don't know if Tony Angelo has one. I know um, Lucky Costa has one. I know David Freiberger has one. I know Mike Finnegan has one. Go join their YouTube channel. All right? They had 5.5 million people on Motor Trend. Freiberger has 22,000, I think. And Finnegan, I think, has like 300. I don't even remember how much. He's got a decent following. Still not enough to jump out on your own and say, hey, you know, my good paying job, I'll leave behind. All right? So... Hopefully that helps you guys. If it does, like and subscribe to my channel. Check out the cars. I do have car stuff, you know. And hopefully this helps you and clears up some confusion. One day in the future, you never know. They may stop showing free episodes. But like I say, the other shows that Discovery does are free. Alright, so if you want to go watch Deadliest Catch, you can watch last season's Deadliest Catch. Alright, so I don't think they're going to change that format. And if they did, they'd probably change it on every show. And then, um, oh, there's one other thing I was going to touch on here. That's skipping me right now. But, you know, like I say, go out and join their YouTube channels, support them. If you believe they should do that, you know, they're not going to have, you guys aren't supporting them. Everybody's saying, I'll follow you wherever you go on his Facebook. But nobody's jumping out there to join his YouTube channel. That's some following, guys. All right. So, anyways, hopefully that helped you. Hopefully you understand where you can find it for free. Um, I did notice one thing that after you watch an episode and then turns into the next month, that previous episode is locked and they unlock the newest episode that's eight weeks old. So if you're on YouTube, it'd be new to you. So there is that. And then the season from now, it will probably all be unlocked anyways, because it will be probably on discovery somewhere. So hopefully that helps you guys. Hopefully that saves a little confusion there, you know, and you can still watch it for free right now. They may change that, I don't know, but for right now you can still watch it for free. So go out there, sign up to their YouTube channels, give them the support on their YouTube channels, alright, and also, you know, go watch a free episode. So, see you guys later, hopefully that helps.